Hello dear friends! Hi, it's me Katie. It's 11.27 on November 28th, 2019. This is my last video as an 18 year old. Whoa. That, guys, today is Thanksgiving and tomorrow's my birthday and the fact that tomorrow's my birthday is not set in at all. It's about to be my birthday in like a half hour. I was not set in at all. I keep saying it doesn't feel like tomorrow's my birthday. But when I just said that this is my last video as an 18 year old, it really sunk in that I'm about to not be 18. I'm about to be 19. That's like the weirdest thing ever. Cause you know, 18 is such a big age. You're finally like an adult or whatever. It's like so weird. Like I've been 18 for so long and saying I'm 18 for so long. And now it's going to be so weird. I literally had to say the other day. I literally, no, not had to, but I literally said the other day, like, oh, I'm going to be 19. I was like, so weird. Thinking I'm, now, right now, I'm really having that realization of, oh, I'm gonna be 19. It's my birthday tomorrow. Wow. I'm literally looking at a poster from my, one of my birthday parties from 2012. Funny. It's from Sweet and Sassy. Sweet and Sassy. An ultimate spa party at 3.45 a.m. Sunday, December 2nd, 2012. <laughs> so I really quickly wanted to make this video because I've made it for several years. I think I did my 17th, my last video was 17 year old. My last video was an 18 year old. Uh, That didn't make sense because this is my last video as an 18 year old so i did my last video as a 17 year old and i guess it was my last video as a 16 year old i don't know about that 16 year old that doesn't sound right but maybe i think i did i think i did whatever it doesn't matter i did it as a 17 year old and like yeah i wanted to make sure i could do it i literally just remembered it as i'm sitting watching a thanksgiving competition a cooking competition with papa and i literally just remembered it just in time and i'm really happy about that because i now have you know, I have a half hour, so, yeah. Um, so, 18 was a, you know, another great year. Very blessed to be here, to be alive, and to say I got to live to another year. Knock on wood, I still got a half hour. Um, 18, 18 was a good year, yeah. Um, I am literally trying to get caught up on Instagram, got get caught up on my posting. My posts on Instagram make me really happy because I like seeing my memories, all there i like going through them seeing my pictures like I, it's strictly for me like i go through these crazy like put like because i get i get behind on posting from when it comes to the summer and then it just spirals and it was a really bad spiral <laughs> spiral this year where i'm really really far behind so i'm trying to get caught up so i'm just looking at memories from the year and i really just thought about like i just every year i'm just blessed with amazing memories of my family my parents and i'm just very blessed and this week alone, I'm very blessed with fun memories. And I've had lots of birthday celebrations already. That I'm very thankful and blessed for. And I'm really hoping 19 is another awesome year. I am just very blessed and appreciative. I, you know, I've learned a lot in my years. I've learned, you know, this is my first year of college, college freshman. And, you know, it's been rough, but you know, I almost threw it. I got two weeks left to high school, then a nice break, and then I go to Disney World! As an 18 year old, I got accepted into the Disney College program. That's the coolest and most amazing thing ever. Wow, what a realization right here. Like, just trying to think about things that happened while I'm 18. Wow, look at that. Like, mm -hmm. oh, I could cry. This has been my dream since I was eight years old to work. Well, so I've always loved Disney since birth, but when I was eight years old, I found out about the Disney College program, and ever since then, I wanted to I wanted to do it. Um, so for ten years, it's been my dream, and it finally happened as an eighteen year old, October first of twenty nineteen. It happened as a freshman in college. Crazy! I'm just so blessed and appreciative and thankful. I'm literally, ow! What was that? That hurt. In my PJs. Um, literally, it was fun. I was like so tired sitting out there in the living room. I was like, oh, I just want to go to bed. I'm so old. But I was like, no, I want to make it to midnight. Half hour, it's 32 now. <laughs> but it was just so funny. I'm like, oh, I'm so tired. I'm just always so tired. It's been a crazy, awesome, fun week. I saw Frozen 2 as an 18 year old, and Frozen 2 was absolutely 20 out of 10 amazing i loved it so much with all my heart i saw it sometime earlier this week um i can't remember exactly what day it was 
to Monday, Monday, I think. Um, I went to Disney earlier this year, and that was an amazing trip. Got to do so much with my family this year. Got to do so much with my family alone this week. So blessed and thankful about that. It's just so crazy. It's just so crazy. And I am so extraordinarily blessed for everything I have in my life. Today is Thanksgiving and all I can say is I'm so thankful for my family, my friends, my life, and everything I have in my life. Our house or apartment, whatever you want to call it. Um, the food we get to eat. You know, there's just so many diff different things that I think people take for granted on the daily. You know, me alone, like I'll take things for granted. And there's things you just need to realize that, hey, if this was gone tomorrow, it would have more of an impact than you think. And you just got to really appreciate it. We as humans just take a lot for granted. And I really, that's why I appreciate the holiday, Thanksgiving, because it makes people sit down and be like, I'm thankful for this. I'm thankful for that. And it makes people tell people that they're thankful for each other. And I, I truly believe in that. I feel like everyone should tell people that you love them, that you're thankful for them, you know, as much as you can every day, not just on days like today where it's a thing. Every day you should make sure you, the people you love know that you love them, know that you're thankful for them, know that you appreciate them. You should just always tell them that and always make sure they know that. Because truly, you have no idea when that person may or may not be there for you to tell them that. So yeah, so... As an 18-year-old, I got to make a lot of fun memories. I struggled, which that's life. Life is going to be like that. Life's going to be a struggle. Life's going to be frustrating. Life's going to be hard. But it always gets better. And even though my first semester was hard in a lot of aspects look i got my i got something i've wanted for years the disney college program and i couldn't be more thankful and more blessed and more excited for it so i can't wait and i'm going with my best friend georgia and that's just the, so great and i'm so excited and so happy and truly i'm gonna like you know it is the best feeling now i'm going with her because you know, you guys know, I love my family so, so much. I do everything with them. I'm home, like, every single night because because <laughs> I don't like college and I love my family and I want to be with them. I come home every night to my parents because my mother is the most amazing, extra, extraordinary, extraordinary mother. She just goes above and beyond for me and John does everything for us. And we literally, like, I appreciate, we appreciate, like, I appreciate her so much we literally do not deserve her she is amazing the most incredible mother um so you know moving down there it'll be hard not seeing my family but you know obviously it's you know my dream um but it'll be so nice knowing i'll have georgia literally one of my best friends with me who will be there with me you know it will be it's just so nice knowing i have one of my best friends going with me who gets me and understands me and loves me and loves Disney just like I do. And we'll just be able to have this experience together. It's something we both have really wanted and now we're getting it. And it's just amazing and awesome. The coolest thing ever. Oh my goodness, I can't wait. And I'll be experiencing all that as a 19 year old. Crazy! Oh, it's so weird. On November 29th, 2000, I was born at 4.35 p.m. I entered the world and apparently it came out. I was ready. I was like, Oop, time to come. Um, time to come out into the world. It's a lot like me today. I'm ready. <laughs> um, so yeah, I hope 19 is another amazing year. Obviously there's ups and downs with every year, but there's always some craziness as a life. But I believe in myself and I know I got this and Katie, future Katie, just keep telling yourself, you got this, because you do. And remember, please don't overstress yourself. I'm sure if I go back to the last video as a 17-year-old, I'm sure I said that to myself. I didn't listen. I didn't listen. Never do. Stop overstressing yourself. Stop with the overanalyzing. You have too much of it. You need to stop it. Stop it. <laughs> um. Yeah, stop overanalyzing. Stop overstressing. Breathe, child. You need it. Um, you are amazing. 
I'm really proud of you. I am really, really proud of you. And I don't say that enough to you. Like, I know it, but I need more moments like that with you and I, with, you, with us. We need to have more of those moments of just, I'm really proud of you. Look at that. My heart's happy. I know your heart's happy. I'm extraordinarily proud of you. You are an incredible kid. Well, adult, whatever it is. You do a lot. You're a great friend. You're, you're a great daughter. You know, you do a little bit more to help out around the house, Katie. Come on. Step up your game. I know you're tired a lot. College really takes it out of you. It takes it out of you. Over break. There you go. Over break, you'll be helping out mom. Helping clean. Do the laundry. And if you don't, that's a smack. Boom. Get it together. Oh, it's 38. We're almost there, guys. I'm so tired. Literally, since I've started college, I've just been tired. So tired. I'm tired. Is that dust or an orb? Please be dust. <laughs> oh. But you know, I'm very blessed that earlier this week I got to celebrate with my family who is normally in Arizona. I got to celebrate with them, my grandparents, and my Aunt Allie. I got to, they all sung to me. And, you know, it's just, it's really awesome because usually, it's so funny, I told, I told them, I was like, it's so funny, usually we're celebrating Gianna's birthday because they come in during summer. So it was, it's like, it's so weird that we're actually like, it's my birthday, like, it's so weird. Like, it's just, I'm not used to it. <laughs> so yeah, and then tonight, uh, earlier today, I was at my dad's, and our entire family was over. We don't even normally have the entire family over, which was really cool. Um, they sang to me as well, which was really sweet. And then tonight at my mom's, it was just me, Bubba, Mom, and John, and they sang to me. And it was just really cute and really sweet. And a little bit ago, Bubba sang Happy Birthday Eve to me, which really did start to get me excited for my birthday. And, you know, I'm, like, now that we're talking, like, you, you and whoever's watching this, like, it really is starting to wake me up and be like, oh my gosh, it's my birthday. Like, oh my god, it's my birthday, I'm gonna be 19. That's just, like, the craziest feeling. Like, 19, like, here's the thing. I thought 17 was boring, and 17 ended up being one of my favorite, like, years, kind of. Like, I just really loved it. So, maybe 19 will be another 17. Who knows? you know because like eight like not that 18 wasn't good 18 was good um it was just funny because it was like 17 is like you know 16 is the sweet 16 18 is the adult year 17 is just like that filler year but i ended up being like great so it was like funny maybe 19 will be another great year i always you know pray for great years for everybody um great long years <laughs> um I also don't like jinxing myself, so knock knock. <laughs> Nothing knock back. I don't need ghosts in my house. Thank you. Um, but it's my last year as a teenager. That's the craziest thing to think about. It's my last year as a teenager. At 18, I loved you. You were great. I loved being able to say I was 18 years old. Hi, I'm Katie Neustarner. I'm 18 years old, and I'm about to be 19. Crazy. <laughs> so weird. I really loved being able, to, being able to say I'm 18. I don't know why. I don't know why that is. I just liked it. like the sound of it. I don't know. It's just special, I guess. I don't know. Um, and I guess because I've just been saying, I guess because maybe i noticed it more but i just was asked a lot for my age like oh how old are you 18. i don't know maybe i just noticed it more this year because uh, I, I don't know it feels like i was asked a lot more this year how like how old i was and having to answer at 18. i don't know why it feels like that i guess a lot recently because like people with my birthday coming up i don't know maybe it's all in my head i don't know but it's 42 now um happy birthday katie Thanks, Katie. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy times. And it's cute. George is hanging up to text me. Callie already sent me the cutest birthday message earlier. 
literally like I was reading it like towards the end of Thanksgiving dinner at my dad's I had it like under at the table I know guys shouldn't have my phone at the table but I wanted to read Kelly's text messages okay leave me alone I was reading it I was literally about to start crying at the table <laughs> oh I also I had my birthday nails been a tradition of mine for many 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 years mm, probably before 14 but like i want to say 14 i don't know it's been a tradition of mine to get birthday nails and i love these years so cute i literally got them so short because <laughs> they got so long it was bugging me and i was just like yeah i need to get them short i didn't expect them to be this short but i'm really happy that they're this short because it's just really nice from having ridiculously long nails that were starting to kind of hurt to now having really short nails that don't affect me at all. <laughs> but yeah, so. Yeah. I like want to say more, but I really don't know what else to say. <laughs> I'm just really proud of myself. Um, and I, I'm excited for what the future holds. But I'm just, you know, enjoying the now. Enjoying what I got. Enjoying my family. I'm just very blessed and very thankful for everything I have in my life. And, uh. Let's hope 19 is a great year for me. I'm just uh, proud of 18 year old Katie. Um, I know college has been a struggle for her, but let's all have our fingers crossed that everything going forward is happy, happy. I believe in myself. I'm really happy and really proud of myself. And you know what? I'm proud of myself for making it this far. I'm just proud of myself. I've gone through a lot. I'm still here, still here. Knock on wood. <laughs> I'm just really proud of myself and really thankful for everything I have and all the memories. I'm really thankful for that. And can't wait to see what the future holds. Happy birthday, 18 year old, almost 19 year old self. I'm 18, going on 19. I was literally thinking earlier, I was like, what songs have anything to do with being 19? Like none, we need more songs. We need more Thanksgiving and 19 year old songs. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If it's your birthday too, happy birthday. I know it's Alexa's birthday as well. We share the same birthday. Well, it'll almost be our birthday. We still got it's eleven forty five, so we still got some time. But happy birthday. I love you guys so much. Be your amazing self. Be positive. Spread kindness and positivity. I love you guys. Bye from eighteen year old Katie. See you when I'm nineteen. <laughs>